Welcome back to Drug Talk, everybody. In today's video, I want to quickly go over three things that you should be aware of before using Xanax or Alprazolam. Number one, how long does it take to work? Xanax is taken orally and it is quickly absorbed into the bloodstream. It is considered to be an intermediate acting benzodiazepine in terms of speed of onset of action, with medications like triazolam and halazepam acting faster. Some patients may experience a reduction in anxiety just 5 to 10 minutes after taking a dose of Xanax. However, some sources cite that 15 minutes is the shortest amount of time. All patients should experience the benefit of the medication within one hour after taking a dose. Xanax reaches its peak concentration and circulation within two hours after taking a dose of the medication. Number two, you must be careful in terms of when you take your dose due to sedation. In terms of percentage, about 45% of patients who use Xanax will experience sedation. Now this would depend on the dose that you're using, however caution should always be exercised. So you wouldn't want to do things like drive an automobile or operate heavy machinery just after taking a dose of Xanax unless you really know how the medication makes you feel through experience of using the medication. Xanax is typically taken three times daily, so you can see how this could affect the life of an individual if they are experiencing sedation. And number three, after starting Xanax, you may notice a change in your appetite. Unfortunately, it's hard to know whether you will experience an increase in appetite or decrease in appetite as both are possibilities. 7 to 28% of patients experience a decreased appetite and 7 to 33% of patients experience an increased appetite. Interestingly, most sources of information for Xanax don't give a percentage of how many patients will lose weight due to the appetite change. However, they do cite that 3 to 27% of patients may gain weight. This could also be due to the difficulty in exercising while experiencing sedation from Xanax. And that's it for three things you should know about Xanax. Take care.